Hello, hello, and welcome back, or welcome. I am Book Love Laura, and this year we're doing Bookmas with Christmas Mickey Mouse ears on. I mean, all this is doing is making me wish that I was in Disney at Christmas, which is like a big dream. One day, one day, one fine day, it will happen. I'm sure, I'm sure it will. It's, fingers crossed. Fingers cross, cross everything, please. I want to be in Disney for Christmas. Not this year because mask wearing. You know, I don't want to be like, hi Mickey, with my mask on. It's just, you know, it's just not as enjoyable, is it? So we'll we'll wait a few years, then we'll get to Disney at Christmas, and I can wear my new Disney Christmases. They've got little antlers on it. Aren't they cute? Aren't they cute? So. If any of you don't know what Bookmas is, it's essentially videos through December, book related and both either Christmas related or like wrapping up 2020, favourite books of this, favourite books of that, um, what I'd wish I'd done, blah, blah, blah. And then thinking about 2021 reads as well. So it's kind of to wrap up the year, I'm going to be having more videos than usual. So this is my little rundown video so that you know what's coming and when and just so that you can enjoy my ears because this is what I'm going to focus on for my whole video. I love these. I sh Oof. Oof. Okay, so not including this video, this is the introductory video, there are going to be 12 videos. 12 videos of Bookmas. Everybody does this slightly differently, this is just the way that I've planned it. Um, I wish I could have the time, the energy and the creativity to do a video every day of the month but uh, I work full time and I still want to read books, so there's just not the time in the world to be quite honest with you. So with my trusty notebook, I'm going to take you through the 12 videos that I'm going to be doing this month. So first video will be on the 2nd of December and it will be my December TBR. So you will actually have this tomorrow if you're watching this on the day that I upload it. So the books that I'm planning to read in December, you know they're all going to be Christmas books. I mean. What else am I going to do in December? You can't read like horror or beach reads in December, it's just not right. The second video is going to come on the 4th of the month and it's going to be what books are on my Christmas wish list, which my mum hounded me for and I was like, mum, wait, I need to wait and see if there are any more books to put on it. And it was essentially me making a Christmas list for my mum was basically me putting loads of books on there and then panicking because I know she wouldn't just want to buy me books and trying to find other things that I want in life and it was it was stressful I'll, I'll be honest it was stressful I managed to think of some other things but I put the books at the top so that she knows the books you know that's that's the that's the golden area so I'll take you through what books I put on my Christmas wish list and the third video is coming out on the 6th and it is the books that I wish I read in 2020 now, I'm dubious as to how long this video is going to be because, uh, well, I, yeah, no, actually, there is quite a lot that I wish I'd read this year. So that will be interesting, uh, to say the least. We'll, we'll see. Watch this space on that one. The next video will come out on the 8th and it will be my Christmas book recommendations. Now, I don't even know, sat here right now, without looking at my shelves, what my Christmas book recommendations would be. I've got my one that I think everyone who lives in Cardiff should read, but you guys don't all live in Cardiff, you live in other parts of the world or the UK, so we'll, we'll see, I, I'll need to look at my bookshelves because I know I've got some, some ones that I love, but off the top of my head, because you only read them in December, I can never remember them, which is not good, but yeah, we'll have a Christmas book recommendations. On the 10th of the month, we're going to have my year wrap up. I'm worried about this one. I'm very worried. This is going to be all the books that I bought this year. <laughs> and I've bought a lot of books this year. <laughs> so logistically, I haven't quite figured out how I'm going to do this one yet because um, there's going to be a lot of books involved and I'm going to need a lot of space. I'm going to need like side tables to take you through and also the logistics of me figuring out what books I bought this year I mean how am I gonna figure that out maybe like my old Instagram stories Ooh, I don't know 
looking at all my orders online possibly i don't i'm not sure uh but yeah we'll see how that goes um yeah so that one was the 10th of the month the books i bought in 2020 a year wrap up i'm nervous i'm nervous on the 12th of the month you are going to get your first reading vlog a week of christmassy reading let's hope there's all kind of like hot chocolates baileys christmas films involved the heart of the matter is that I work a lot, so possibly not, but you know, I'm going to try my best. I'm going to be zooming through these Christmas books that I've got planned. So uh, yeah, first Christmas vlog on the 12th. On the 14th will be my favourite reads of 2020. I think this is basically going to be like my five star reads for the year. Yeah, and we might call it that instead, actually, my five star reads of 2020. Uh, apart from the books that I've reread, because I reread a lot of books which I gave five stars to, but there have been a lot of books this year. I think it's been quite an up and down book year. There, are, I feel like there's a lot of books that I gave five stars to, but then a lot that just didn't even get close. That were like low. I've had quite a lot of low rating books this year, or what I would personally see as low rating books. So that will be an interesting one. On the sixteenth, we are going to be judging Christmas books by their covers, which. To be quite honest, I'm a big judger on covers, aren't I? And I'll just probably say they're all amazing because they've got cute covers because it's not very often that you get a bad Christmas cover. So, you know, do with that information what you will. They, you know, sometimes it does do me a service, judging books by the covers, but not always. On the 18th, we're going to be doing the Bookmas tag by Sophie series. I've seen people do this before. I just thought, why not throw a little... little Bookmas Christmas tag in there, hey? On the 20th, I'm going to be kind of setting out the feelers for my 2021, God, that's a big number, isn't it? Reading plans. So that's going to be uh, something that I don't stick to because I make all these plans and then, uh, you know, I sidetrack. So, oh well, but at least I will have shown willing in my plans on the 18th, yes. On the 22nd, you are going to have another Christmas vlog because who doesn't love a Christmassy vlog? And obviously it's going to be reading and Christmas books and more Christmassy things. And I mean, I'll have Christmas smells and like trees and stuff and you can see them. You won't get the smells, but you'll get the fun, the ambiance of the Christmas vibes. So that'll be fun. And the last video of Bookmas, which will come out on the 24th, will be books I'm looking forward to in 2021 so like new releases things that are coming out which i'm looking forward to getting my hands on and devouring i've actually already got quite a lot of books on my goodreads that i want to like pick up next year so i'm excited i'm very excited for 2021 reading but i'm also more excited for my december christmas reading and there we have it that is the rundown of my bookmas videos for 2020 first year of bookmas going to be stressed filming all these videos, it's going to be fun, it's going to be Christmassy, yo ho ho Merry Christmas, or is that yo ho ho a pirate's life for me? It's ho ho ho, ho 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 Merry Christmas, god I'm because I'm in the Disney vibes I feel like I'm on in you know Magic Kingdom going to Pirates of the Caribbean, yo ho yo ho pirate's life for me, Ooh. no that's it's Merry Christmas around here simply having a wonderful Christmas time. That's what we need to be on the vibes of. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Happy reading and I hope you enjoy the bookmas videos. Bye!